Now, Ringo, I'm going to count to three. And when I count three, I want you to let go your gun, put your palms flat on the table, and sit your ass down. And when you do it, you do it cool. You ready? One, two, Okay, now you let him go. Yolanda, I thought you were going to be cool. Now, when you yell at me, it makes me nervous. And when I get nervous, I get scared. And when motherfuckers get scared, that's when motherfuckers accidentally get shot. Just know, you hurt him, you die. Well, that seems to be the situation. But I don't want that. And you don't want that. And Ringo here definitely doesn't want that. So let's see what we can do. Now, here's the situation. Normally, both your assets would be dead as fucking fried chicken. But you happen to pull this shit while I'm in a transitional period, and I don't want to kill you. I want to help you. But I can't give you this case, because it don't belong to me. Besides, I've been through too much shit over this case this morning to just hand it over to your dumb ass. Vincent! <laughs> be cool! Yolanda! It's cool, baby. It's cool. We still just talking. Come on, point the gun at me. Point the gun at me. There you go. Now, Vincent, you just hang back and don't do a goddamn thing. Tell her we're still cool. Still cool, honey bunny. How we doing, baby? I, I gotta go pee. I'm gonna go home. Just hang in there, baby. You're doing great. I'm proud of you. And Ringo's proud of you. It's almost over. Tell her you're proud of her. Proud of you, honey bunny. I love you. I love you too, honey bunny. Now, I want you to go in that bag and find my wallet. Which one is it? It's the one that said bad motherfucker. That's my bad motherfucker. Open it up. Take out the money. Count it. How much is that? About fifteen hundred dollars. Okay, put it in your pocket. It's yours. Now with the rest of those wallets in the register. That makes this a pretty successful little score, huh? Jules, you give that fucking Nimrod $1,500 and I'll shoot him on general principle. No, Yolanda, Yolanda, he ain't gonna do a goddamn motherfucking thing. Bitch, shut the fuck up! Shut up! Come on, Yolanda, stay with me, baby. Now, I ain't giving it to him, Vincent. I'm buying something for my money. Wanna know what I'm buying, Ringo? What? Your life. I'm giving you that money so I don't have to kill your ass. You read the Bible, Ringo? Not regularly, no. Well, there's this passage I got memorized. Ezekiel 25, 17. The path of the righteous man is beset on all sides by the inequities of the selfish and the tyranny of evil men. Blessed is he who in the name of charity and goodwill shepherds the weak through the valley of darkness, for he is truly his brother's keeper and the finder of lost children. And I will strike down upon thee with great vengeance and furious anger those who attempt to poison and destroy my brothers. And you will know I am the Lord when I lay my vengeance upon you. I've been saying that shit for years. And if you heard it, that meant your ass. I never gave much thought to what it meant. I just thought it was some cold-blooded shit to say to a motherfucker before I popped a cap in his ass. I saw some shit this morning made me think twice. See, now I'm thinking, maybe it means you're the evil man and I'm the righteous man. And Mr. Nine Millimeter here, he's the shepherd protecting my righteous ass in the valley of darkness. Or it could mean you're the righteous man and I'm the shepherd. 
And it's the world that's evil and selfish. Yeah, I like that. But that shit ain't the truth. The truth is, you're the weak. And I am the tyranny of evil men. But I'm trying, Ringo. I'm trying real hard to be the shepherd.